This paper uses machine learning to estimate the global abundance of airborne particulates for environmental health studies. Airborne particulates have a massive impact on human health. More than 50 million Americans have allergic diseases, including asthma. And on a global scale, the picture is even worse. The World Health Organization recently released a report that estimated in 2012, 7 million people died due to air pollution, and a significant fraction of that was airborne particulates. So PM2.5 can really be considered to be an invisible killer. Given that it's so important, if we look at the measurement sites across the world, we actually see that they're at a rather limited number of locations. Every red square on this map is a site where airborne particulates are being measured on an hourly basis. This comprises more than 55 countries and more than 8,000 individual sites. So what we've done in this study is relate the measurements made on an hourly basis at each of these sites to global data sets from remote sensing, meteorology, and the population density. Then we've learned a nonlinear mapping from the ubiquitously available products to what we really want to know, the airborne particulates, so that we can estimate their abundance on a daily basis at 10 kilometer resolution for the entire planet. When we look at these estimates and compare them to the individual in situ observations, there's actually a remarkably good agreement. So that's what this paper's about. I hope you enjoy it. Thanks for your time.